Director Nitesh Tiwari is back with another film. This one is called Bawal, starring Varun Dhawan and Janvi Kapoor in lead roles. Is this film worth your time? Let's find out. And if you want to watch this video in Hindi, then click on the link in the description. Hi, I'm Ashwin Kumar and you're watching the film. Bawal is conceptualized by Ashwini and the screenplay is penned by four writers. Piyush Gupta, Nikhil Mehrotra, Shreyas Jain and Nitesh Tiwari. The story is centered around Ajay, aka Ajju Bhaiya, played by Varun Dhawan. Ajay is a history teacher who has sort of created this bubble around himself that he is a revolutionary and will change the entire dynamics of UP or Lucknow by his good deeds. The bubble pops as soon as he enters his personal spaces. Personal spaces being the one that he shares with his family and his wife and the bond that he shares with his best friend Bipin. Let's talk about some merits and demerits of the film. Ideally, there is only one way with which you can define a film. It is suspension of disbelief. It is the ability to allow yourself to temporarily believe something that is not true. That is called film viewing or watching a film. So this film correctly hits the G spot there. It is it requires you to believe what you see. But once you successfully remove the entire logic thing and IQ thing, the film becomes watchable. Not just watchable, likable as well. The screenplay has beautifully inculcated scenes of World War II, has beautifully incorporated sequences where we see the current protagonists of our film stuck in situations of World War II, the film also provides plenty of trivia related to history and information and becomes sort of a mini documentary in portions which is not boring at all thanks to the amazing background music and the way the screenwriters have penned the screenplay. It is the second half where the film picks up pace and from there on there is no looking back. When we move to Europe with Ajay and Nisha, the film becomes a completely different story altogether. And there are portions, especially in the first half, where this film takes many dips. The first half is difficult to sit through, but as soon as you step into the second half, the film becomes watchable. As far as the performances are concerned, Varun Dhawan puts forth a good act. Nothing to shout about, but he has managed to understand the assignment completely. But in scenes, you can see him mimicking or paying tribute to Govinda or Anil Kapoor because he copies the style in some swagger scenes. But in second half and when the transformation happens, he has acted really well. Janvi Kapoor is good in emotional scenes. And I have said this time and again that she needs to work a little bit on herself. I love her choice of scripts. I love the roles that she is picking up for herself. But her South Bombay accent intrudes here in a story that is set in Lucknow. Manoj Pahava and Anjuman Saxena as Aju's parents are amazing. They are a delight to watch. With a film like Bawal, there can only be two possibilities. After watching the film, either you will love it completely or you will hate it. Because creatively, it hit those marks right. But at a storytelling point of view, it lacks, especially in the first half. Bawal is a light watch streaming on Amazon Prime videos. For more videos like this, subscribe to The Flake Addict. My name is Navjot. I shall see you next time. Goodbye.